Hey, hello everybody, welcome back to Eternal Sonata, alright. I have not played this game in uh, quite some time, because the last couple of times I played this game... Oh, yeah, that's right, there was a boss right in front of us. <laughs> this is, this is correct. Okay, I haven't played in a couple of days, and I've been playing Star Ocean for like the last uh, couple of weeks there. So just let me, just let me fight a fight. Where the hell are we? Where are we? Oh. <laughs> just let me fight a fight. To get back into uh, just the action, on, just the, me what you've got. the action in this game. <laughs> Are you catching on yet? <laughs> Let's go show this boss what the deal is. Yeah, I've been playing Star Ocean like crazy for the last uh, couple of weeks there, ever since it arrived, man. Hello there, big boy. Oh, my God. <laughs> he has no face. <laughs> That's actually super cool, man. He's got like a thing over his head or something. Ah! <laughs> I fucking... Oh, yeah. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> tapping, 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 tapping. Oh, 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 God, sir. Oh, God, I love that move. That's so good. Mm. Oh, mm. <laughs> oh, that will be all. Oh, yeah, gosh, ah. Forget the pain you felt in the dream. Oh, oh, oh I blocked early. Oh, yeah. Ah, get up. <laughs> get up. Pulse out, no. Pulse out, please, please, please. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah! Uh. Oh, he blocked Falsetto's Phoenix Rising. I'm out. He went around the bag. Ah, you backstabbing bastard. Eat this, and this, and everybody eat a club. What? I blocked that! That's not a Okay, so we basically gotta be standing like right in between his legs. <laughs> ah! Come on, come on, come on. Ow! Ah. Oh, he's a very good blocker, I must say. Uh... Uh, uh, come on! Yeah. Don't you dare block this! Oh yeah! Ah! Uh, yeah! Uh, yeah, he's weak! Oh. Ah. Oh. oh, you're getting it, sir. No, Freddy, why? And then he blocks. Ah. 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 You 
don't know me, sir. Oh, you're so dead, bro. Uh, oh, 20, you guys, goddamn. A single touch. Snowclaw. Block this. Yeah. <laughs> God. Triple up. And we got Tears right arm. Right arm. at the end of this journey. The end of the journey? Hmm. Well, I really don't know, but I'm sure that the road does lead to somewhere. Salsa, I don't think that's what he means. I think that what Frederick is talking about is something of a more spiritual nature. I believe... This is going to be my final journey. But my final destination is shrouded in darkness. No matter how hard I look, I cannot see it at all. No, no, no! Darkness. What are you talking about? Darkness. The way you talk, you think you're about to die soon or something. I guess I'm the same way. I can't see where I'm headed in the end either. I don't think anyone can really see that, except maybe God. But the reason I can't see it is completely different from why you can't see it. The place where I'm going is surrounded by light. And because the light I'm heading for is so bright, I can't make out what's there either, the same as you. So you can't see because it's either too bright or too dark? Then it's probably better to go with not being able to see because it's too bright. I agree with you. After all, no one can ever really know what the future will hold. The only thing you can do is live your life as best you can. So basically, what Salsa said was right. <laughs> Salsa's like, yeah, the yeah. The road does lead to somewhere. sand of time begins to flow. I think what we're supposed to do now is go to the basement, if I recall correctly. This place takes a while to get through. I remember the first time I played this game, I was like, what the hell is this? <laughs> but it's just to give you a, a long enough chance to level up your characters. Pardon me, I'm just doing the old uh, searching for treasure boxes behind walls trick. <laughs> Switchy switch. Swappy swap. Swappy swap switchy switch. Alright, we gotta make our way back down to the bottom, to the basement. To the basement! I can see where you're going to end up. <laughs> Yes. That was a piece of cake. 
Beat Boy Beat. God, I love Beat. <laughs> Beat's just like the coolest character, man, I swear. Oh no, where are we? Where do we go? Uh. Where are Get me, Mr. Onion. This goes down. Fifth, fifth, fourth, fifth, <laughs> fifth floor. Yeah, we need to go to the basement because the sand. Uh, remember when we went to the basement before? You couldn't get past that. Like, like it just goes down, and then you just can't go anywhere from there. Well, now that the sand is falling, it basically fills up like the bottom floor, allowing you to like transition from one side of the, uh, from one tower to the other. I can remember wandering this place for hours the first time I played this game. <laughs> From the top to the bottom to the top to the bottom to the top to the bottom, god damn. We're just trying to get down to the bottom, that's it. Oh. Huh, please tell me there's a path going down up here. Ah, uh, treasure box. Uh, save point. Picking on weaklings really isn't my style. <laughs> <laughs> this place is like just level up city, you know. Wait until we do the um, <laughs> the mysterious uh, unison there. Those battles give you like friggin' <laughs> doesn't it just give you like ninety nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine experience points or something like that, <laughs> or more. I think each enemy gives you that much. It's like you level up to max in this game pretty quick when you're in the uh, <laughs> mysterious unison. Down? Nope. No down. Leave me alone, sir. <laughs> Will not tolerate these games from you any longer. Don't even think about it, Mousy Bowie. Yeah, we'll fight a couple of enemies uh, a here and there on on our way down. <laughs> Hmm? 
you need to be at pretty high level to do the mysterious unison anyways. Because the enemies in there, uh, you know, they might drop a bazillion experience points, but the <laughs> they're also uh, pretty strong. Alright, first floor. Now this brings us to the basement. <laughs> now I'm confused. Let's see if there's another pathway down. No, fuck off. Fuck off. I'm looking for something. Leave me alone. Fuck. Oh, you fuck dead. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Oh, you son of a bitch. damage because we're too close. You. I'm trying to do something, you son of a bitch. I don't think we've been on this side. Have we been on this side? <laughs> I don't know if we have or not. Check for treasure boxes. To which there is none. Bum, bum. what happens. I think we have to go up this tower now. Don't we have to like release more sand? Yeah, I think we have to ascend this side. We'll definitely know if we haven't been up here if we see an unopened treasure box. I really like the music for this area too, because it's like, uh, it's almost like the rocky music, you know? It's like you're, go <coughs> you're going up the endless uh, staircase to the top. Uh, 
kind of blocked early. Come on, come on, come on, get up. Uh, had enough. <laughs> Turn around. <laughs> God damn it. Ah, oh, what's up? Yeah, that's right. Oh. Teardrop. Oh, it's an ultimate weapon for Polka. Oh, and we forgot to check Tear's right arm, you guys. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> the arm of the one handed god Tear that was bitten off by Fenrir, going from 389 to 406. Ooh, and that is uh, one of the ultimate weapons for Falsetto as well. Alright, going from 315, Jesus, to 343, the teardrop, the umbrella of the nymph Eurydice, who longs for her lover. <laughs> her lover. <laughs> Annihilation. Where are we? Okay. Let's go up this way first. Looks like a dead end. Ooh, safe point. Guess that's where we're supposed to go, so let's head back. <laughs> in this direction. Can't see. Oh, I'm glad I went wide. Look at that, okay? Yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
Come on, treasure box. Goddamn. <laughs> awesome. Oh. Ooh. Uh, how do I go down quickly, man? You know what I mean? Tap, 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 tap. <laughs> Needed to redo the item set after that boss fight there. I can't see which way he's facing. Amazing fight if I got the kill there. <laughs> Ooh, triple up. Maybe it's time to upgrade. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> you know. Level 56. Save point. Oh, wait, we have to, um... There we go. <clears throat> Make sure we're staying with our, uh, even levels. Well, thank you guys for coming up and watch the episode. Of Eternal Sonata, we have reached uh, the half an hour point here, and and the save point, which is uh, kind of perfect, right? I love finding a save point right at the end of a video because it's like so perfect to end the video there, right? We've reached that point. But yeah, man, thank you guys for coming out and watch episode of Eternal Sonata. You guys do me a favor, leave a like on the video, maybe even subscribe to the channel. Uh, make sure that you're actually still subscribed because YouTube has been removing subscribers. You guys, dirty little rats, they are. But, uh, freaking love you guys. Wish you guys the total best. Hope you guys have a freaking awesome rest of your day. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Have a good. Bye bye.